All right, we're here. We're here. We're here. We're here to save the day. And we're after some of the, some of the videos. That react. The shows <laughs> of the episodes of The Hills that were on in 2009. Is you think we're in 2009? I think we're in, I think we're, it's earlier than that. 2008. I think it's 2008. I think it's like November <laughs> of 2008. Deal? November? I don't know. New York is was really oh, beautiful was nice. at that point. May? I think it was, yeah, May. September? Let's just say. Well, it's great to have you guys here. Welcome. Welcome. We're I hope nobody's upset about anything that's happened. This is the <laughs> third episode we're doing, so we haven't seen how the first two have done. Maybe someone's upset at us for some reason that we don't, but we don't know. But that's okay. Yeah, that's okay because... People make mistakes. People and make mistakes. We're all work in progress. <laughs> Everyone deserves a second chance if they really understand and are sorry for what they've done. Did you ever hear the philosophy that once a man admits that he is wrong, that he's immediately forgiven for all wrongdoings? Have you ever heard that? Yes. And I am really sorry for what I've done. You haven't even done anything wrong yet. <laughs> Don't manage their feelings. Did that smell, smell like my cleave sweat? Mm, Whitney cleave. All right. Oh. Hello, I'm your anchor host, Tim Rosen. And I'm Whitney Poor, and we're coming to you live from Studio City, California. Our address is 378 19th Street. And a big story today is lunch is on its way, so let's start the episode. Do you think it's, it's going to rain a lot in New summer. York this year? <laughs> <laughs> Previously, Previously on, on Skrillex. Whitney, Whitney is hot. Facts. I'm looking for so someone the leaks. to come in as a Facts. Coordinator. She's got the Rachel. I've always wanted to work mm -hmm. for a designer. I uh -huh. think it's part of the fashion industry that I've never been able to do. And she was ready to take a chance on a new life. What I really need to keep in the back of my head is I'm doing this purely for the job and not for any other reason. But we all knew there were other reasons. I want to get back here like as soon as possible. Are you going to stay? I really want to, you know? I want to get out of LA. Everyone was telling Heidi that Spencer was no good for her. There's your boyfriend to see her. Can't you. let people like that influence your life. But she just didn't listen. He's been doing nothing but push everybody away, push all your friends away. And now he was about to convince her to do something that couldn't be undone. Marriage. It can be undone with divorce. Oh, we will love Mexico. Woo! We're here. Hello. Yes, hello. Oh, wow, it is hot. Oh my gosh, look at the ocean. What hotel wow. do you think they're at? This is insane. Oh, I love hotel. it here mm -hmm. so much. Yeah, I think it's nice to get out of town and everything, you know? But why now? Our relationship always is best when it's just you and me. I feel like it's always other people trying to tear us apart, whether it's your former best friends or your sister or your mom or my sister. It's just when it's not that, it's work. I feel like I was never going to see you, so. Well, I must say, Mr. Pratt, this is definitely one of your best surprises. I have a feeling, my dear, this will be the most memorable vacation of your life. Buckle up, baby. Buckle up. <laughs> Ooh. I heard that. Dirty window, uh, midnight thoughts that you cannot find. Ranger. You cold? It's your inhibition. Feel the rain on your holes. Holes is on a TV show, the remake of. I think you already said this, and she has a baby. No, that model tilts her head back has a baby. Hollis oh, yeah. is on like a remake of Dallas or like one of those 80s uh, dramas that I met and watch. Pacific Design Center, yeah. shout out to that place. People's revolution. It's like, what do we do here? What do we make? What do we sell? What do we provide? Nobody knows. This morning, I'm on the phone. I'm okay. on my Gosh, black Thank you so much. That's unbelievable. Congratulations. 
Honestly, thank you so much. Just tell me when and I'll be there. Okay. All right, bye. Did I got it? the job. Did did I swear. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's enough. Uh -huh. So you know at this point, give us a little BTS here. Yeah, so um, I knew I got the job, but I... And the city was already, like... Yeah, the Picked city up and the, were gonna happen. Exactly, okay. it was and already it was already underway. We didn't have to shoot like a whole pilot and stuff because they had this all done for done for the hills, mm -hmm. right? Did we shoot a pilot? I didn't work on the be very beginning of the city. I came no. on mid season one, mm -hmm. so I don't know. But I could imagine that they like like Adam could have just gone into MTV and been like, "Look, I want to do a spinoff with Whitney," and. They would. They wouldn't have been like, "We'll shoot a pilot of it first. They would have been like, "They'd probably be like, okay, like, yeah, you know, you have been crushing it for this network for four years now, so yeah, enjoy." Yeah, and like we said, all that stuff had naturally happened, so they didn't even really need the pilot. So yeah, I was. I knew this was happening. I. That said, they could have been like, "No, yeah, okay, go shoot a pilot, and then we'll see." I don't know. I don't know. I, they. I don't recall that. It's okay. You don't have to have it right, and we're not going to check. But I, I was freaking out. I was freaking out. I was freaking out. Because I was like, this show, now I'm like doing a, a TV show. Right. I was more nervous for that than for the job at DBS. Mm -hmm. You were like, now they're going to follow my personal life and I'm going to really be on this show mm -hmm. for the first time and mm -hmm. not just Lauren's reaction friend. Well, all right, let's see. Let's see Are you it. taking it? I just have to... Go for it. Oh my gosh. Dude, I am on first and first. I know, it's so <laughs> crazy. You're like, <laughs> time. You know, the perfect job and the perfect boyfriend. You're gonna leave behind everything and just have the perfect life. Oh I can't God. think about it like that. I don't wanna get my hopes up. I'm going there for the job. I'm going there for the job. Wait, we get it. We're not going for a guy. Yeah. There's just a guy there that you should date. And that's amazing. Oh my God, I have to call my parents. <laughs> They're gonna call freak them. out. We have to celebrate. Yeah, I think we can have a little goodbye drinks. Congratulations. Thank you. I have a chance. Whoa, ho, ho. now we're talking. This is a delivery service if I've ever seen one. Thank you. Woo, look at me, pro pro. Monsieur, may I get you some shampoo? Of course. This here? Is there a man? Oh, whoa. We get uh, cozy you. like this. Feeling uncomfortable. Cheers. Cheers. You stopped stressing out yet? Yeah, I think the champagne took it all away. When we met, you really never got stressed out. You were such like a carefree party I know, animal. I didn't have my mom yelling at me and my sister. And this I... is the reason why I brought She you. really does not resemble... The person she once was? No, not even just physically. Like, I kind of forgot about the Heidi from the first season mm -hmm. and like her whole outlook and attitude. Mm -hmm. Here, because this is our life. It's time for Heidi and Spencer time. Well, I'll really work on not letting my family affect me. And I will work on trying to not let your family affect me. Great. Thank you. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. Adrena's got a weird car. Yeah, what's going on? Adrena's like, Lauren doesn't live here, Stephanie. I love this. You like it? I like I'm all the plants. Isn't that pretty? Justin's here. Uh, Hi. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? I don't know, you guys are still hanging out. Oh, yeah. Have a seat. What have you been up to? <laughs> He's right now. You're good. Really? Look, How are he's you? right there. Have you talked to Heidi? I wrote her a few days ago, but I haven't heard back from her. We were supposed to go shopping. She you just never showed? No. And like for us, like to have plans is kind of a big deal because Spencer and I aren't really getting along. Heidi and my mom talk every day. They're really close, mm -hmm. and even my mom doesn't know where they are. Or maybe they're in Santa Barbara. They always go up there. But they would need keys from my parents. So then they're See, there. my mom and I have like gone through the list of places. Hmm. 
It's just like really uncool if they did go somewhere and they had to take a plane ride. Our like rule in our family is you call before you take off and you call right when you land. For them just to kind of disappear is weird. You should put up some signs. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> she thought about that so <laughs> They actually became good friends, Justin and Stephanie. That's nice. Mm -hmm. They're at the Me by Malia Cabo. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Shotsky Totsky. Shotsky Totsky. She's making me want to drink oh. and go to Mexico. <laughs> oh, I heard snapping. That's a move. Yeah, we made a sticker Arriba! out of it. <laughs> Are you even going to remember this conversation tomorrow? Right, I know yeah. how you are after a little Patron. <laughs> um, what if we were to just go get married and then don't tell anybody and then it's just us? Like a loco and la cabeza, For real. <laughs> for real. <laughs> Think you've had one too many Patron shots. No, for real. <laughs> Let's just go get married. For real, Jose. It's the only way it's ever going to work out. I'm being serious. Well, and... me too. OK. Uh, okay. Go shots, Patron. Or your, your most top shelf uh, tequila, even above Patron. What's Nothing is above <laughs> Patron in 2008, no, my Patron friend. Patron does to me. What? It's from, crazy. <laughs>Switch it up. Because you're moving, so you're going to switch it up. Okay. So, I don't know who that guy's left, but that one who's the profile is that guy, Brandon Goodman, who's Billie Eilish's manager now. Remember I talked mm -hmm, told you about mm -hmm. him? There is my ex-brother-in-law. Mm -hmm. There is Sydney. Mm -hmm. In front of her is that girl, Cassie. Remember mm. my friend Cassie? Uh -huh, and no. then there's my brother with the baseball hat right, on. Right. Cassie was my college roommate. I'm, I'm hugging Sydney. And she's sad that you're gonna there's balloons. There's yeah, balloons. they were really sad. Leave. I think a couple days. I know, I know. I can't even talk about it. I'm really sad. Cheers! Where in Sydney? Hey. Ashley. That's Whitney's sister, Ashley, yeah. in the mini bow tie thing. <laughs> so pretty. Hi. Hi. How are you? We've never met on the show. Hi. I'm low. Hi. Oops, I just sit there. Hi. Okay. How are you? I'm good. How are you? What? Oh. Brody and Sleazy T got the invite? Blair's like, I will hook up with that. I feel like they were also casting my friends at this point. Or like, mm -hmm. seeing mm -hmm. about... Who could come yeah. with you? Yeah. Are you coming back? Or come back every weekend and see us? <laughs> Yo, yo. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Dad. I'll be back. Sad. Sweet, girl. I'm really proud of her, though. It's a big deal to move okay. across the country, like, away she, from like, family. She, like, know people that live She has, like, one friend in New York. And a boy. You may have a crush on me, but you're not dating him yet. I'm not dating him. What is he doing with his arms around you? <laughs> He's like, should I stay, Brody? And should we live in Malibu together? What did he just say? He said you may have a crush on him, but you're not dating him yet. Yeah. He, you know, he always got, has an angle. He, it means, um, according to the How to Pick Up Chicks handbooks, I can still uh, get on you. <laughs> just like, what? Do we, we, do we know each other? Yeah, dude. Like, your friend splashed me in the pool, and then I left, all right? I don't even know you. But I don't want to. <laughs> when have we ever? Stephanie came over today. Doug is we not on the show. He said Heidi and Spencer just totally disappeared. Nobody cares. Ask Nana where they are. You know, everything is a, is such a nice time when people are happy. No <laughs> one's like, oh. Hey, everybody. Oh, I just wanted God. to make a toast. We couldn't be more proud of the fact that you've progressed the way you have with dignity. We hope that you have all the success, and we hope that you maybe even convince them that you can run their West Coast office and be back here shortly. Love you and... And be safe. And be safe. <laughs> okay. Cheers. 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 And come home. <laughs> Oh, 
Finish that. Yeah, I'm being so serious. I want to go marry you. I don't know, Spence. I feel like your mom. We don't have to your tell Nana, anyone. That's mom, the whole point. What? It's a secret Mexico wedding. It's for us. It's like we've been through so much. And my, I just, I just don't want to be a, in a relationship that's not going anywhere. I'm ready to get married and take it to the next level. You mean it's not going anywhere? Of course it's going somewhere. We're, we're never gonna get married with yes, your family. We are. Yes, your mom we are. will never approve of it. And you don't have to tell anyone. It's our secret marriage. No drama, no stress, just you and me. You're no plan. Serious. I mean, he's like no drama, no stress, except for like the like pressure that I'm putting on you now that you have a secret wedding without your family. I'm not crying, don't worry. No, okay. Good. Breath. You can feel your feelings. Mm -hmm. You think we should really do it? Heidi, yes, he does. when I'm with you, you make me want to be nicer, and that's why I just am madly obsessed with you. And it's pretty apparent the fact that I haven't left your side in nearly two and a half <laughs> years, and I pretty much keep you from the whole world. You are just my angel. It's like that proposal has a few red flags on it. Nobody. It'll just be you and me, about us, for us. I promise. It, I promise. It has nothing to do with anybody but us. Let's just go do it. Let's just. Just do it. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Let's do it. <laughs> He's like, it only took seven <laughs> shots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa. Well, Save some for the honeymoon, <laughs> y'all. Sure yeah? Like Save some kisses for the honeymoon, <laughs> yeah? We're going tonight. I guess so. We're going tonight. <laughs> We're not in Vegas. <laughs> He's gonna get married in that sweater vest. That's a fact. They didn't pay their bill. Pink? Andrina? You were definitely keeping your hair so back with other stuff. pieces of hair. Yeah, that's for sure. Like you're leaving it. I know. I just can't even imagine like living in this city. It's like when I go to the grocery store, do I take a cab there and just bring all my groceries with me? Do I get a bicycle and get like a basket and carry everything inside? <laughs> those, are, those are fair questions. I'm gonna be sitting at my desk, staring at my computer with no one to look to. No, <laughs> no you'll make like, new good friends. FYI, like, what do you do in New York if you, if you don't have your car? and you get a lot of groceries. Like my mom would go to the grocery store, she had three kids, we, she would have like 10 bags of groceries. Mm -hmm. She can't carry that on her own. The grocery store was 10 blocks away. You... Get them delivered. Oh, oh. You would shop and then an I hour still, later they would deliver it. Oh, uh, I still did all my grocery shopping. I would, I would go there and, and walk. Just, but I was only shopping for myself, so. Yeah, just went in. But it was a workout. You didn't me. shop for Roxy? <laughs> she did her own shopping. No one like you though. I feel like we've really grown up with each other. 
my first memory of you was our first date. We had our hair all done and they changed our outfits. It's a little too matchy matchy. Oh my god, matchy, so matchy, active. wait. Oh my god. I would dare someone to come change your outfit now. When someone was like, oh, you matchy, up. matchy. Matchy, matchy, that was totally our first day. Oh my god. Uh, was the DKNY show up. the first thing we did? It no, the Young would. Hollywood party. Did she just yell at you? What? Did something just happen? She was like, Hi, I'm here now. Here. Do you need me to put my mic on? When I let Heidi in. We only knew then what we know now. Seriously, that seems like so long ago. Mm. Don't cry. <laughs> I kind of went into it looking at it as a job and I didn't expect to get a friend. Never. Never? She does, she seems genuine, which is nice. I really think that we got so lucky to have found each other. Freaking out. <laughs> I'm so, so I'm in love I'm with you. Super special. You are super I'm so special. Proud. I get it. So excited you're going away. I'm just it's a little sad. I'm sorry. I know. I'm really excited for you though. Oh no, Lauren. I'm honestly like so touched that we've like come this far. Oh, she seems hey. sad. Because she likes you. I give her credit. Agreed or disagreed? I I kind of remember the producers like egging me on to try to like shed some tears. So I think that they did that for her too. They're like, this is, you know, you guys have like been through so much together, blah, 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 blah. blah. Last I lunch of lemonade. So <laughs> <laughs> I think that was the last time I ever okay. ate at lemonade. I love, I love you too. I'll call you once I'm there. Ooh, who's Escalade? My dad's. I, think I, think I, saw a paparazzi I was a just of about to say there are a lot of paparazzi shots of that scene. Here's some. Did we stay here? Me yes, for Jade's <laughs> wedding. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait a second. The me, right? We said yeah. that before. I have a picture of me and you sitting in these chairs with a guy in a uh, crazy speedo. Yeah, I think they redid it. It looks different. You're yawning? I am worn I love out. the day I got married. I'm beat. <laughs> well, hello, Mrs. Pratt. Hello, Mr. Pratt. Oh, wow, I love saying that. You're the most amazing wife ever. You had this plan the whole time. We we're going to come here and get married. The day before I booked the trip, I didn't know if I could actually get you to do it. I think the Patron helped a little bit. A lot bit. You didn't a feel too good last night, A lot bit is not the same. Well, don't give me too much tequila. I'm so hungover. What is his I ring and what is dangling oh, from it? It's like a little locket. Oh, oh my uh, lord. Oh, oh. Let's drop the camera. Look at this. This is it right after walking out. No, it's wow. not. That was nighttime <laughs> last night. I'm very what were you confused. Really when we walked in that chapel. They got married I this morning. I didn't think you were going to do it. I was just... Nervous and scared. Oh, I don't think I've ever been that nervous in my whole life. And I was just like, I'm getting married right now. This is crazy, and I got nobody here to watch. <laughs> Not one person. <laughs> what? Why are you ta ta saying those things? <laughs> this is such a bad idea. Ooh, yeah. nice ring. Mine too. Little Zsa Zsa Rock here. It's a Cabo special right here. A what special? This Cabo special? <laughs> you naughty wife. Look at that dress, it worked out so perfectly. And the bouquet? Look at that chapel. I just can't believe it. It was just so romantic and on a whim and... I can't believe I'm just watching a That's small enough. video That's amazing. Like, let's reminisce of the last That's night, so but it was daytime. I don't even know what to tell her because she's gonna kill me. I thought you weren't telling her. I mean, how can you not tell somebody something like this? Because like, you're not really married. She is like really gonna have an issue with us being married, I think. <laughs> Wait, are you, what? Now, now it's not happy. <laughs> so confused. 
It's mostly been not happy. It's mostly been bad. What is the, I don't understand <laughs> their ring. What happened to that other ring? Looking for some bling. Where's the most high end? <laughs> Maybe it's like a little crystal hanging off of it. Just something that's been on your mind. Oh, town car means we're going to the airport. Mm. That all will be revealed in time. Thank you for coming, Mr. and Mrs. Pratt. Adios. So you keep on treading water. Just waiting for the tide to turn. And wandering all the while. I'm always like, am I departing or arriving? Like, what do those words mean? <laughs> I was thinking about that on the way. Vintage? No, I love it. Yeah, vintage. DB, take a DB. You're about to get on a plane. Like leave him, leave him yeah, my whole life for New York. Two carry on bags. Better get my big suitcase. <laughs> two carry ons. That should be good. We work in fashion, so they'll have clothes for me there. <laughs> That's what I assumed. Dang, so you're off the show. Next time on the season finale of The Hills. <gasps> Next time. Hi. Hey. I'm surprised. Oh. I don't want you to be upset about this. How can I not be upset? Mm. Yeah, use your brain. Out of LA, no more drama. You're amazing. What is that? It's just a ring. Are you serious? Who always told me about the wedding. I know how to be her best friend, and I know how to hate her, and I don't know how to do anything in between. I got Are you happy? It. The only thing really missing in my life is you, and it's really hard. <laughs> you know. I can't let you go and make this wedding legal. Well, Heidi's my wife. No, so she's not. we'll go to the courthouse and we'll make it legal. So then you'll be my mom. Oh. Hi, Heidi. Take the Spencer. Whoa. <laughs> Play the little. <laughs> um, yours is too big. Make it littler. Perfect. How are you feeling? I'm great. Good. Peace in the streets, you guys. That was a three-er. That was a three-er. That was a three-er. That was major. Major. Let's eat lunch and then subscribe. I'm gonna eat some lunch and then I'm gonna subscribe to some of my favorite YouTube channels. My favorite YouTube channels include this channel and not a single other channel. <laughs> yeah, I don't know Never consumed am. one thing on YouTube except for this amazing video. That's true. What <laughs> else happens? What are you picking <laughs> off your lips? I feel like the most recent <laughs> thing I've ever typed in on YouTube was like, it's like Sunny playing with blocks. And, or just like a how to, like how mm. to set up something. Mm. Let's not, let's actually not end this video by dissing YouTube. Yeah, I love YouTube. <laughs> what is this gritty stuff? Did that just come off my lips? No. Oh, we should wash this blanket. We're gonna do that now. Yeah. We're gonna do that now, then we're gonna subscribe to our own channel because we're not sure if we're subscribed. I'm Are you subscribed? Have you rung the bell? Uh, have you? But really have you. Okay, peace. <laughs>